everybody. I actually have time to do one more video today. So my husband came home and then he, he went back out to do walk a little and get some more geocaching in. But I wanted to show you what I've been doing just recently because I've been trying to figure out how to plan. Um, I don't like to plan as like a planner girl plans. That's really, I've tried. I have honestly, I have tried many times and not succeeded. It's just too hard. I can't do it. But I thought I like to keep a bullet list of things. And then I watched uh, my friend Pramita do how she does a messy planning, she calls it. And I loved it. And that's what I'm trying to do. But um, anyway, I'm just going to give you a peek at that. It's so new yet, but... I put in some cute things that friends gave me. Stuff here. Um, this is a dashboard that I bought. And um, this is actually bullet journal here. But this is more like lists. Like movies, books. It's going to be um, lists of things. To, um, and I have some stuff I have to put in here yet. And then um, my friend Stacy gave me that. And I really liked it. So I put it in here, but I think I'm gonna turn it this way so it doesn't get battered. And uh, there's another uh, cover dashboard. And I have another card that Stacy made me, and I'm going to put that one like here so that doesn't get battered. <laughs> and then this one is just for lists of things that I really need to do, like, um, uh, let's do this. I. I've already completed some things and I just do a simple checkbox and go down and um, like here I need to check our passport, mine in particular, passport due date because I would want to be sure um, to not let that run out. So there's just that type of thing I put in there, got to get doing on. Okay, this my friend Pramita made me, it's like a little pocket folder. And I just have in here all kinds of um, post-it notes, flags, stuff like that. Then this is another cute little dashboard someone sent me. And this little clip, my friend Kathy uh, crocheted these bows. They're darling, and so I put that there. And um, this is what I'm doing for my messy planning, so to speak. I'm just trying. These two pages I had done some September stuff and didn't like what I did, so I covered, just covered them up with some fallish type things. <clears throat> so, this is what I did. Um, and this is all like for me to kind of suggest that you just divide your page, one page per day, divide your page in two. She does more decorating than me, so hers looks really cute. And I could do, like, I could do more decorating in here if I wanted to. I might do a little of that now. I don't know. Um, I'm not going to promise anything. <laughs> um, but, so I just put, like, um, happenings. So, like, Sunday, last Sunday, went to church. Uh, we watched, rented two movies from Redbox and watched them, what we had for lunch, what we had for supper. I'm trying to do the weather down here at the bottom. And then to do stuff. Um... I went back and did these yesterday because I hadn't done it. I had, was prepping. Like, I got prepped all the pages. I've, I've just done this prepping to start the pages. And then I can leave plenty of room. Okay, and this is a personal size. So, same thing here. Just happenings to do. And then I used washi and stamps and stencils and little things I had that I hadn't been using I wanted to use up stickers type stuff I put in here. So I did that. Um, I, like I said, I was back doing, so I really didn't have any to-dos to put on because I did this yesterday, so I didn't even have really any that I accomplished those two days. But Saturday was very busy. And here's today, and I did want to add, I need to schedule the Scrapping Wonders Design Team YouTube. And um, Happy Mails. Ready to go. And I did that. So I'm just going to write who I sent them. I've got them ready to mail tomorrow. So Mona, Cr 
Priya, um, Diana, and Heidi. So I did that. So that's good. That actually was pretty amazing. Oops, and I can't cross that off yet because I didn't do it. And then um, lunch, like, so then I would put in, we had grilled chicken and sweet corn. And then dinner is going to be beefsteak tacos. Um, and then the weather, I didn't leave a lot of room down here, but this is where the weather goes. And I'm going to say um, low 70s which was amazing, and sunshine. It was such a nice day. We've had so many rainy days. It was really nice to have a day like that. Um, so yeah, that that's pretty much how I do it. So like tomorrow, um, I would put like work, I would put if I'm going um, to um, the gym in the morning, um, that is kind of my desire, so uh, I'm going to put Planet Fitness, and I put a box there because I want to be sure I don't, you know, I want to do it. Um, and as far as work, so 8 a.m. to 4:30 p.m. that uh, pretty much never changes. So that's work. And I don't worry about lunch because um, lunch is just whatever um, to do. I'm going to put mail, happy mail packages. And I don't do this, I mostly um, like the to do's, I tr I'm going to just try and do a day ahead. And if I know some stuff that's actually happening, I'll put that in. But see, I'd probably just go like dinner. And then I would go like TV, and of course it's Dancing with the Stars. And then one of us has to make snack for home group, and I think this time it's going to be Doug. So snack for home group. And then I have to be sure to read three chapters for home group. And I'll probably do that at work. And and then I want to write my friend Don a letter. I have a list up here by me of everybody I need to write to and send things to. And um, so I just try and get, so that's what I do. Um, and then I just, if I know something's going on, then I can write it in here. And if I know I need to do something, I can like write that in that I need to do something. Oh yeah, Mondays I always have to schedule the NISM blog post. Now, if I don't get done with what I put down on my to-dos, I'm gonna just move them over here. So this is an experiment to see if I can actually keep up with a schedule, like doing something like this. It would probably be easier, and I really need to get in here and write down some of the things um, that I need to be actually uh, checking up on and doing. Um, and this beautiful card my friend Sintu sent me, and it's she got it in Paris, and it's so cute, and she knows I love owls, and each owl has uh, the month over the head and then in French and then the days of the the cal the month calendar. So I'm just gonna keep that in here as my thing to let me know where I am and I'm not done with this day. So what you know if I want this to look like not just you like a little more decorated because it does look kind of plain, right? You know? And I I wouldn't mind having it look Kind of a little bit cuter maybe throw some fall leaves or something on there because the leaves are changing so I could do something like this 
that I still have my to do, but because I didn't really have um, a lot to do, then that's kind of, you know, what happened. And I did decorate, let's see, Saturday, I decorated for fall. So, you know, maybe a little uh, maple leaf would look super cute here because that was something I did. Um, but going back here to the first, I could like put just a tiny little bit of something, you know, maybe some ephemera. I'm just going to kind of play around and, you know, if you guys don't mind watching, if you don't want to see it, just, you know turn it off. It's okay. <laughs> I'm not going to get offended if somebody doesn't want to see something I'm doing. But I thought, you know, maybe I should just do some little, find some little cute things and toss them in here and it would be kind of fun to just, you know, do some stuff like here. You know, this is kind of cute. And actually, I almost like the red one better. You know, just little things like that. Um, it doesn't have to be anything major. And I didn't drink wine on this day either, but um, it's kind of fun just to do a little bit of decorating whether it's something that happened or not, I don't think that matters. It's just a matter of, oh, I just want to decorate a little bit. Okay, so there, that was kind of cool. Um, let me see if there's something else. You know, there's just, I could do so many things. Hmm, this is kind of cool. I like this. I like these. These Trader Joe's always has these like black and white uh, on newsprint illustrations throughout their uh, thing, and I kind of like it. And um, like something like that would look kind of cool right here, or maybe on a different page. Um, where I didn't have a lot to write, maybe up here. Let's try that. You know, just putting in a few things just to kind of, I don't want to detract from the writing, so I just want to put in a little bit here and there um, that's not going to detract from um, writing of any kind. So here's some more Trader Joe's. So I'll just stick this in, and I'm just doing a really rough cut. I'm not, like, trying to do a whole lot. Um, and actually, I'm not going to put it on the same page where I already did a Trader Joe's thing, because I don't want to do that. I'm going to put it right here. And it's just kind of fun, isn't it? It just gives that little bit of um, something else to the picture to make it interesting. And I think it's fun. So I have another one with cats. I think I'll just put that there because like I said, I ended up with not having anything uh, that I put down as actually having to do. So, since there wasn't really anything, I might as well just put a picture down, right? Okay, there we go. Okay, so, you know, there's a couple other spots where I might just want to put down something interesting. Maybe, like here. Like I said, it doesn't have anything to do with anything. It's just a little bit of a decorative touch to fill up some white space. That's really all I'm doing is filling up a little white space that's in here. So um, 
If I see something and I'm like, oh, that would work in that little spot, then um, I might as well like put it down, right? Because it's kind of fun. I like these things. These are the things I could stick in here too and like do a word. Um, so for instance, let's take this one. And I'm going to put it down. And then I could just put a little, one of my little phrase thing stickers on top of it. Like right here. Okay. And then I could go to my phrases and just pick something, you know, random or whatever. stick it on there. How about I know that I'm home? You know, just something like that. A little random. And then if you want to make it uh, maybe a little prettier underneath, um, I could take a little bit of this washi that's got some writing on it and just tear off a piece. <clears throat> and I could just put it right here. Okay, so just something um, very simple like that can really make a difference. Now I have another little graph box here that could go on another page and I could just like put a word on it, you know, when I'm just trying to fill up a little space. Okay, so I think that looks good. Um, I could use like a little something here. So let me see. Let's put, um, let's just tear off a little washi and put that there. <clears throat> so that's all it is, okay? So that's simple. Now let's go to this page and I put a few random things down and <clears throat> Excuse me. I could obviously put a little washi um, here as well. Kind of like this one anyway. I think it looks pretty cool. Let's put this one up here, okay? And I feel like I, I could put a few other things here, you know. Um, like here, maybe I want um, something a little bit darker. I'm trying to keep the color scheme, you know, a certain way too, you know. I'm just kind of... <clears throat> okay. Um, so let's see if there's anything else that you know, I could put in there. Oh yeah, here's another Trader Joe thing. I really enjoy these little Trader Joe things. I sometimes I don't I don't keep all the illustrations, but I might start keeping more of them just because they um, they're kind of a cool illustration. Okay. I'm just doing a rough cut. I'm so glad that my friend Pramita did a video on this technique of hers because um, it really, it really helps, you know, because sometimes you just don't know what to do. And I don't want it to look like all these blank splotches of whatever, not showing, nothing showing anywhere, you know. So I want to do a little bit. I'm going to put this one like this, okay, and then I'm going to just put something here. I'm just going to take this thing that says simplified, put it there. Okay, so there I have um, something else. Um, I think 
that's good for those. All right, so I'm pretty happy with that. Um, yeah. And then here I did already, and I feel like that this is probably sufficient. So I don't really feel like I have to do anything more. And here I didn't feel like there was anything else needed here either. So then I'll finish up the one thing I still want to do tonight. Um, and then tomorrow's not done and I will, you know, maybe once a week, like at the end of the week on a Sunday, I'll come back and just do a little bit of uh, journaling catch up like this in here, not journaling, but planning <laughs> catch up. So I kind of know what's going on and I can write down things I need to do and you know, maybe this will be a good way for me to um, keep track of stuff. At least I certainly hope so, right? <laughs> but I'm going to give it a try. So far I like it. And it's kind of nice to go back. And actually this can take the place of where I used to just write five lines a day type of thing. I'm kind of still doing that. But this could totally... Um, take the place of that and I wouldn't have to do that which I think would be just fine yeah but I'm, I'm happy with this I'm gonna put this little birdie here just because I do like birds a lot okay so yeah there we go We'll see how this goes, <laughs> but thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it very much. Um, I hope you enjoyed it um, and learned from it, and um, I will try and remember to link Promita's channel below, and uh, because the thing that she did actually on showing this was on Facebook Live, so I don't know that, um, you know, Unless you're friends with her or in a group that she's in where she posted it, you're not going to be able to see see it. But anyway, thanks for watching, and we'll just see how this goes. <laughs> Bye.